door. Out the door. Now. Libyan protesters being kicked out of the Libyan mission in Washington. Is this a free country? Down the stairs, please. This is our embassy. Now, it's not officially an embassy, but this mission is the closest thing that Libyans have to an embassy in the U.S. We just want to show them that the Libyans in America have taken control of the Libyan embassy. Rehab el Haj, one of the organizers of the protest, called the mission hoping to get inside. But they pretty much shut us out. We're kicked out of trying to enter our own embassy. What do we want? Gaddafi out! When? Now! We want to take Gaddafi's pictures down because he doesn't represent us. This is the Libyan embassy. We don't want so Gaddafi's pictures there. He doesn't rep represent the Libyans. So what's happening right now is that several of these protesters actually snuck inside and took down pictures of Gaddafi. Well, now the Secret Service is involved and they're trying to figure out whether or not they can arrest those protesters and it all depends on whether or not the Libyan mission is in the hands of the Gaddafi regime or if it's now in the hands of the Libyan people. Because the ambassador had stepped down, uh, they didn't know who they were taking their orders from, so to speak. Back to the sidewalk. In the end, two protesters were arrested and after two hours, the former Libyan ambassador to the U.S. who resigned earlier this week met with the protesters outside. He said he, he's with the people, absolutely not with the regime. But he still wouldn't let them inside, nor would he talk to us. Is there any way I could speak with you very briefly? Well, uh, I don't think in the office, not in the office, okay? In Washington, Kristen Fisher, 9 News Now.